Hello and welcome to BBC News. The White House says President Trump will make a major statement on Sunday following a tweet from the president saying something very big had just happened. No details have been given of what Mr Trump was referring to, but there is speculation that it could concern the leader of the Islamic State militant group Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi. U.S. media reports suggest he was the target of a U.S. special forces operation in the Syrian province of Idlib on Saturday. Well, with me now is our news reporter, Gareth Barlow. Gareth, what more do we know? Well, from, with regards to the US government and Donald Trump, very little really. Late on Saturday night, like you say, he tweeted very simply, something very big has just happened. No further detail, no further explanation. Over an hour later, the White House put out a little bit more expansive comment saying the White House, the President of the United States, we're making a major statement tomorrow. That's Sunday morning from the White House. But again, no further detail, no further explanation. US media, though, is now reporting that the leader of Islamic State, Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi, is thought to have been killed in a possible operation in Syria. It's worth pointing out, though, the BBC hasn't been able to independently verify these reports and also worth noting that Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi has been reported killed on previous occasions. Just remind us of the man, who he is, why he's significant. Back in 2014, in the Iraqi city of Mosul, Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi announced the launch of the Caliphate, the Islamic State Caliphate, and over the following years that controlled vast swathes of Iraq and Syria, 88,000 square kilometres of land, and obviously wrought death and destruction to many thousands, if not millions, of people as well. And there has then been the international fight back against the group ever since. There was not really any sight or sound of him until April of this year when there was another video released and that lack of information, that lack of awareness as to where he might be has prompted speculation in the past, like we say, of possible killings, although it's now being reported in the US media that there may have been an operation recently. On that note, what exactly is US media reporting on? What are the details? Well, Fox News is citing a well-placed military source saying that Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi was killed by US forces in Syria close to the Turkey-Syria border. The BBC understands from activists in Idlib province in Syria that coalition gunship helicopters were seen in the region late on Saturday night. There was possibly even a landing party. And then the US media outlet Newsweek reporting that Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi may have been involved in a small firefight and possibly detonated a suicide vest when he wasn't able to get away. OK, Gareth, thank you very much.